Okay, so we got the Tomex Zaymont reaction figures. Yes, they lack articulation, as we said in every single video, but they are so cartoon accurate, it is amazing. So there they are. So Zaymont is on the left, Tomex is on the right. Zaymont has the scar on his right cheek, and Tomex does not. And the Cobra emblems are completely opposite. But man, these look so good, man. Look at them. Look, the face sculpts on these are really well done. Again, one thing the reaction figures do where um, other toy lines, I'm not going to mention the other toy lines because I don't want to offend anyone, is the face sculpts on these are way better. No doubt about it. They're cartoon accurate. And for such small figures, look at them. Their faces look really good. It looks just like them from the cartoon, honestly. They really do. If... Super 7, you know, they're doing the deluxe figures, and a lot of people are, you know, on board with it. Some people are not on board with it. I can tell you guys right now, the Super 7 Ultimate Deluxe figures have good articulation. Some people are saying no. I have two of them. Watch our videos. They have really good ballpoint joints in their legs, and they articulate really well. Anyway, back to these figures. I hope the Ultimates come out with Tomax and Zemo because they are cool. They were a staple back in the toy line from 85. Super cool characters, you know, in charge of the Crimson Guards as well. Awesome. Thumbs up. These are one of the better reaction figures done by Super 7. I strongly recommend grabbing them. All right, guys. Take care.